as we conclude our series on the O Antiphons, we gather on this, the 23rd day of December, and we begin our time of reflection and prayer. We have heard Jesus named in each of the antiphons leading up to Christmas as O Wisdom, O Adonai, O Root of Jesse, O Key of David, O Morning Star, O King of the Nations. And today we hear the most intimate of names, O Emmanuel, O Emmanuel, you are our King and Judge, the one whom the peoples await and their Savior. O come and save us, Lord our God. Emmanuel, God with us, God choosing to dwell in and amongst humanity, God using human flesh to bring back humanity to himself, to restore us into relationship, to bring us back to paradise, communion, unity with the divine. It is by Christ's incarnation that we have a hope of eternal life in God. Oh, ask our Father to save us from our sins and lead us forward into new life. May your Son bring us freedom. The Baptist preached a change of heart, free us from self-satisfaction. May your Son bring us freedom. The Pharisees refused the Baptist's witness to the coming of your Son. Free us from fear of the truth. May your Son bring us freedom. The Baptist was glad to make way for him. Free us from pride. May your Son bring us freedom. The dead longed for life. Free us from death. May your Son bring us freedom. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be your name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom and the power and the glory, for ever and ever. Amen. Almighty God, now that the birth of your Son is dawning, we pray that your eternal word who took flesh in the womb of the Virgin Mary and came to dwell among us, will show your unworthy people the greatness of his love and mercy, who lives and reigns with you and the Holy Spirit, one God, now and forever. Amen. 